But when a grizzly, believed to be one named Kenai, launched a rock he found in his pond at the Minnesota Zoo, the glass shattered. <laughs> Animals' mouths are. Kitty, kitty. Ginimo, CNN, New York. He wants her. Look. He's going nuts, dude. Unprotected baby. Oh, I like you. All right, let's let's go. I don't want this pink up. He's freaking out. It's like teasing him. Holy crap. He wants to eat our baby. Oh, nice, I got it! Good job, good job. <laughs> wow. Grizzly, believed to be one named Kenai, launched a rock he found in his pond at the Minnesota Zoo. The glass shattered. That bear was throwing a chest pass repeatedly. The ball, the rock bounced off the glass right back to him. He threw it five times, says Robin Ficker, a lawyer who was visiting the exhibit and who has himself exhibited some animalistic behavior as a sports heckler. But Kenai the grizzly wasn't being aggressive, says Tony Fisher, the zoo's animal collection manager. He was just playing with the rock. Kenai is one of three orphan brown bears transported from Alaska, where Fisher says they might have died if humans hadn't taken them in. He is kind of a clown. But when the glass shattered, Robin Ficker didn't think the bear was clowning around. Run, because we all thought that bear was coming through. The exhibit glass is two and a half inches thick. The bear only managed to shatter one of five layers. The zoo says no one was ever in any danger, but don't tell that to Ficker. I was thinking, well, if he gets out, he's probably going to enjoy one of those nice, tasty kids rather than an old grizzled piece of meat like me. Replacing the custom-made glass will cost tens of thousands of dollars. Zoos just have to put their money. Those of you through Bob Water Zoo are going to get a great look at Eno as he comes right by. Oh. Eno's our resident male looking to us to point to find the Sewer Aquarium at the home of Washington for you to And as the team came out in 2003, <laughs> did he smile at you? He's the largest animal in the aquarium here today. Now, besides the Eno's thing, he's also easy to recognize because wow. he's a more white. Is he a large bear? Wait, you are looking at Eno. Yeah, I'm not least, we're at the Apollo Water Viewing Area. You take a look on the back of the area. You may see a gray whale poke her head up from time to time. Thanks, man. 
And that would be the coo. The coo's our largest female. She's 11 feet long and 1,500 pounds. There she goes right there. Here he comes. Here he comes. <laughs> Look at she's saying hi. Here, Kaza, turn around. Let me get your picture. Hurry, Carlos, hurry. Oh, got him. He's gone. Mm -hmm. See how his back is silver, Carlos? It's because he's the boss. He's the boss. Santo, stop. Stop. <laughs> because you were jumping. Yeah. He thought you wanted oh, to be boss. It. Nope. Oh yeah, wait till he walks away, sure. Is he still hiding? Is he still hiding, buddy? Oh. Put your face up against the window. And then just stays in the second place. 